467 properties are on the market in Denton County right now. Hello everyone, Jay with JMarks Real Estate and today's mid-month market update is going to be covering the market here in Denton County and some neat things happening in the real estate space on a national level and some wonderful things that I think you need to know about right here in DFW. Let's get started. First of all, in Denton County, like I mentioned, there are 467 houses on the market as of this morning's MLS report, with 186 properties going under contract in the last week. Also so far this year, on January 17th, there are 363 closed properties. Denton County is off to a great start, and we're tracking right now 47 properties coming to the market. So if you ever want to know what's coming to the market ahead of time, give us a call. We'll provide you a list of anything marked coming soon in the MLS. People can get a great advantage by knowing something before it actually happens. Give you a chance to drive by the neighborhood, see the home on the outside, things like that. You know, the real estate market is fun and I want to do something different today. Can I share my screen with you? I want to show you a couple things that are happening right here in DFW. First of all, I'd like you to take a look right here at this part. It's called Market Watch, and we can set it to a number of ways. But so far this year, there's 1,663 properties coming on the market in the last seven days MLS wide throughout DFW. But look at this one. This one's interesting. 511 price increases. People are raising their prices. Good grief. That's something we normally don't see. But something else we normally don't see is this one expired. In the last seven days, 136 people were not able to get their home sold. Could you imagine being in this crazy seller market and not getting your home sold? That's exactly what happened there. And these folks, sometimes, I don't know if it was a pricing issue, condition, who knows what happened, but that tells me that things might be on the path to a slight change. You're probably wondering what is going on in the real estate market. Well, first of all, we have the everlasting problem that goes right here. The housing crisis is the housing inventory crisis will continue in 2022. Now, if you do want to subscribe to an incredible magazine learning about the real estate space across the country, I recommend recommend housingwire.com. Housingwire.com has been a great source of information for me and I love it. And here are five predictions that they believe will happen in 2022 in the real estate space. Let's go over them together. First of all, they believe the interest rate on 30 year fixed rate loans are projected to average three and a half percent in 2022 average. We do know there are going to be at least three increases this year, if not more. Home sales will rise to a 16 year high and single family price growth will start to slow, they believe, to an 8% rate in 2022. There'll be less homes being refinanced, but the larger cash out share and loan delinquency remains low, but with an uptick in distressed sales. Now, what does that all mean for us? It means there are opportunities out there. It's kind of like they said in Star Wars, bringing balance back to the force. We believe that by the end of 2022, we will start seeing some changes. And in 2023, it's going to be a lot more balanced with more opportunities for buyers, etc. But for right now, people still need a place to live. And there are almost four people moving to DFW every 60 seconds. That being said, I'd like to share with you a couple of things we think you need to know living here in DFW. First of all, have you had an opportunity to check out our blog? I'd like to introduce you right now to our blog. If you go to jmarksrealestate.com slash blog, you will see everything from our Foodie Friday episodes to articles we do in the area, and we find it super, super helpful. First of all, Foodie Friday. We've been doing this for eight years, telling the stories of local owned restaurants and bringing about the stories of the owners, the food, and what makes them tick. This is so much fun to do. It's a service that we do for the community every single week. Whenever we do these stories and tell people how they can go in there and enjoy a meal, learn about the owners and the chefs, it makes it, I don't know, more personal. And I've met more friends in, real st in the restaurant space than ever before, and I've learned so much. It's completely um, amazing, to be honest with you. Another thing I want to tell you guys about is our blog also shows you I'm going I'm to turn back to this real quick. Give me a second. Thank you for your patience while we're doing this live today. I'm going to show you this here. Good. Our blog not only does Foodie Friday, but we also have a charity piece here called Denton County Giving, where we tell the stories of local charities. And you can always find out what's happening here in your community. 
We have some really cool articles coming out this week on some places that you can go and play inside to get out of the cold weather with your family. One thing that we've learned here by putting together this show, talking about real estate, talking about the area and the community, is people are always wondering what they can do, where they can go eat. And I'd like to just take a minute, for those that are watching that are good friends, thank you. Thank you so much for the compliments and for the messages as people reach out to us and ask us, hey Jay, I'm taking my wife out to a special anniversary dinner. Where do you think we should go? Or are people just taking us for telling them about the new restaurant that opened here in town? I have something kind of fun to share with you. You ready for this? Let me get the screen ready here first. It is our anniversary. Tomorrow, January 18th, is the sixth year anniversary of J Marks Real Estate. And I'm super excited. I've got a really neat team here, and these guys are the best. And we just added a new member, Jonathan, our videographer, who's helped me edit this video right now. Jonathan, good luck. You got your work cut out for you. Welcome to the team. But for the last six years, I've had the privilege of selling real estate under the banner of J Marks Real Estate. Starting my 29th year in the business, almost 30. Can you believe that? In 2023, Three, it'll be 30 years of selling real estate. Um, it's been a real privilege, but my favorite part is having my own company. Um, and now I just want to say this. Thank you. Thank you for your support. Thank you for your friendship. And thank you for your business. If you're curious how your house is positioned in the real estate market today, we invite you to take a look at our website and you can find out how you can get your home valued. You can also see what we believe sells homes. We believe it's great marketing and we have all the tools and everything you need to get your home sold. So whether you're selling house or like we did this weekend, we sold this 1500 acre ranch in South Texas. It doesn't matter. We have it ready to go for you. My number is 972-724-2540. I would love to talk to you. If you're buying or selling or just want to know, hey, where can I go get a great meal? We hope you're having a great week. And this is your Mid-Market Update for the second week of January, 2022.